Hey guys, uh, just a quick video to raise a, uh, a bit of a safety brief that's been identified in the uh, Gen 3 and 4 light storm vehicles. Um, this is only for the Gen 3 and 4 light storm vehicles, which Campbelltown has two of, um, and it refers to the seat belts in the rear, so the bucket seats that are in the rear of the vehicle. Now the issue with it is in the seat belt. So if you notice under this cover here, you'll notice there's a seat belt uh, loop just here. The issue is when you put the seat belt on, if you pull it out to the side, like so, the seat belt gets jammed up in here. So you can see up here, it's jammed. Now, if that makes it very difficult to pull, if I was to continue pulling that, I could quite likely do some damage to that seat belt. So the issue with that, that's the, that's the issue that has been raised. Um, they're, they're working with the manufacturer to try and uh, you know, create a fix for that, but that's the issue. The way to fix that, if, the, if it is like, if you do find the seatbelt like this, um, gently feed it out and pull it back across if you can. So try and get it out from that jam very gently and then just feed it back in. So if you do find it, it, is, it has jammed like that. Um, you may not be able to see it because of the, the cover. You can remove the cover by just taking, undoing the screw on top and the cover just slides off. So there's a screw just up here. You can undo that to get to the cover. Um, so what they're saying, the correct way to do this is grab the seat belt and pull it out in front of you. So pull it directly out in front, buckle it in, and then feed what's left back in. So the idea being that you're not pulling this, if you pull the seat belt like this, as you can see, it's starting to jam up. So the idea is you, you can see it's just, it's gone limp, it won't retract. So try not to jerk it or anything, just gently pull it through until the, until the sash becomes free. And then pull, so the best bit is pull it forwards in front of you until you've got enough. Then just hold the seatbelt whilst you uh, click it in, and then be careful to, to feed it back in gently. Okay, all good guys. Also, if you do find the seatbelt is damaged, so the webbing is um, is you know cut or frayed, um, identify that with your team leader slash truck driver, um, and tag the seatbelt out. So put a bit of danger tape on it, and let let um, logistics know, um, and do not use that seat. Thank mm -hmm. you.